Hi there, uh, welcome back to my channel. So today, um, or actually yesterday, I received um, my Bundle Monster. Um, it's like an itty bitty stamper. I will leave the link down below. Um, my friend Terry recommended it and I was kind of hesitant to buy it because it was a little expensive. And then, well, with, with the exchange, because um, I'm Canadian and it was American, I figured, you know, I was being cheap. But then they had the Black Friday sales and it was on sale. So I decided, okay, I'm getting you. So I got this. Um, Terry loves it because it's very small. And um, she says that it's easy to pick up single images. So I figured I... Uh, it's kind of nice not to be able to get, you know, get tape or your, um, uh, your lint roller and trying to pick off parts of the stamping you don't want on your nail. Um, so I figured I'd give this guy a try. There is, um, a, a bit bigger one and then this little itty bitty one. So I have this plate. Uh, this one is a BP 121 and it's got a lot of little tiny images. So what I wanna do is try and just pick up a single image and then I'm gonna stamp it on one of these nails. Um, I've already got my nails done and um, I figured it's hard to stamp on these nail wheels because you always go over the edge. So I figured using this would be a perfect test. So let's get, um, just get some Born Pretty green polish and try it out. So let's take the cap off and let's try this little Eskimo dude. So it did pick up a little bit around the sides here, so right there and right there. So, ah, lucky picked up really well. So let's try another image. I think it's because I, I went over the edges, so. Hang on one sec. I wanna. Okay, so I just I needed to get my wiper to clean my plate. So let's try this little reindeer. I was calling him a moose before, but then everybody's like, "No, he's a reindeer. He's a reindeer." It's like, "Oops." Oh, he's kind of cute, and little bit on the edge and I think it's the way I'm stamping. Oh, I cut off his ear. But I think that's just me and my horrible stamping skills tonight. Let's try this guy one more time and do an... Actually, I'm gonna try... Try the candle. I think it's because I can't see through the back that it's kind of throwing me off. I don't know. So I'm just taking it off so I can see. And I don't think it's anything with the stamper. I just think, it, you know, my eyesight isn't the greatest. So let's see if we can do this little snowflake. keep going crooked but you know what it's actually doing amazingly well 
Like I think more of it's like the user me that's not picking it up all that well. So let's try scraping that way. And then rolling. So I got a tiny, tiny little bit of an edge. And then, oh, I went a little high. But I think he did really good. So I really like the stamper. It's really cool to do like single images like this. This is awesome. Because I hate, you know, oh, Hi there, sorry, I'm back. Um, I just had a little coughing attack there. Anyway, um, I actually really, really like this little stamper. I like the fact that it does have the bigger stamper. So it, it'll actually, it'll fit on my nails, but it also has this little tiny one where you can just pick up little single images and I think more of it, um, of me trying to pick up and center it, is because I'm doing it on camera and it's not closer to me. So, um, but um, it picked up for shot. This was the first time I've tried it tonight. Um, no priming or anything needed, which was awesome. Um, and yeah, very cute little stamper. I really like it. So thank you, my friend Terry. Um, I'll link her, her links below. Um, she's Gypsy Rose Nail Art. Um, she recommended uh, this stamper to me. And uh, so I'm glad I grabbed it. Um, it's really cute. It came with a little, little card. And I like the card because some of them I find are really flimsy. This one's kind of like a medium, um, you know, or thickness. So it bends well. So it's easy to scrape with. Um, yeah. So, highly recommend it. I like it. Anyway, thanks for watching, and um, I hope you have a great day. Bye.